Previously on Office Makeover Episode 1, I mentioned some of my plans for my home office. And this is the inspiration we're going after. And I did a little something to get me in that direction. While slowly getting ready to do the bulk of the office revamp, in order to get things moving, I decided to do things in a priority order. My posture and my back pain has the priority. And I've been noticing that my posture has been slowly changing in a bad way. So I'm now doing exercises to correct my posture. And a good office chair carries a massive importance for your posture. After doing a lot of research, I found a chair that fits my needs and matches my budget for the office remake. I decided to give the Felix King ergonomic chair a go. I got it off Amazon so it got delivered the next day. To be honest, I like building stuff that's more free flow rather than following a guideline. For example, from sanding to finding custom legs and designing the look, I built my own office desk as well as my three tier shelves. But when the box showed up for the Felix King chair, I was not so excited about the setup process. But to be fair, it was extremely easy to set up. It took me about 15 minutes to get the chair set up. As I was unboxing the parts of the chair, I noticed the good built quality. Each part feels heavy and I think that's a good sign. This chair has one lever and it functions as the height adjustment as well as pull to lock or unlock for back tilt. The arm is also pretty adjustable as well. They go back and forward as well as turn for resting positions. The chair also has these interesting roller blade style wheels. They are sturdy but be careful do not roll them on your toes as that would really hurt. The one thing that was a must have for me was the neck support. I really wanted the chair long enough to have a neck support. I like to have a contact point as I know if my neck is placed here, I'm in a good posture while sitting. So it does act as a good reminder. The neck support does go up and down as well as tilt. The lumbar support was also a must. My lower back already feels a lot better sitting on this chair for the past few days. As a bonus, it really helps that the seat itself is elevated and fully mesh. I wanted a fully mesh chair. And the mesh itself seems very dense and high in quality. My goal is to build my studio space for comfort, add more useful tech, and introduce entertainment like adding a TV. I'm so happy that I stopped procrastinating and bought my first ergonomic chair. I'm happy to sit here as I believe comfort has direct correlation with productivity. There are two things I do not love about the chair. Now I'm not a tall guy and I wish the seat itself was a little larger for more comfort. Secondly, I do think the rollerblade wheels are cool but seriously, watch your toes, they could really hurt. Overall, I'm super happy with the chair. Felix King did not sponsor or send me the chair. They are slacking. <laughs> now, office chair is out of the way. It is time to move towards other steps of the office makeover. All right, so there are a couple more additions to my home office studio. I got the Quintus light bar to relieve eye stress when working at night. You can adjust different brightness levels and different levels of temperature based on your setting. I also got a desk monitor arm to be able to elevate my monitor and not look down onto the desk to improve my posture. Now that's basically what I did for now. I'm still gonna go ahead and do the painting in here, but that's probably gonna be within the next couple months. I'm going through a busy time right now and for me to paint the space, I have to move everything to my bedroom, paint and then move everything back. It's gonna take a lot of work, so i rather move that to the next couple of months. But there will be smaller stuff coming until the painting point and until I install the panels that I was talking about and as I get more stuff I'll introduce you guys to them. Thank you for watching my Office Remake episode 2 and if you want to get caught up with the Office Remake story go ahead and watch the first episode to see what I have in mind for my home office. Again thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.